Hello friends, this is Karishma and today I am going to show you how to make the image slider in ASP.NET. So for this let me open the Visual Studio 2010 and uh, go to file, go to new, click on website. Here we are creating empty website, click OK. And we have now empty website, go to solution explorer, add one web page, go to add new item. Then I click on web form, just rename it as uh, image slider, image slider, click on add. Now we have the web page name as uh, image slider. This is the source part, we have to go to design part. This is body and uh, I am going to add three image control here, one, two, three. So one more three image control here so we have three image control go to source part add uh, height and width for here height equal to 200 or uh, width equal to width equal to 200 so I am copying this and I am copy it and I am going to paste here and remaining image controls so we have three image controls having the height of 200 and width of 200 so next go to design part <coughs> click image uh, and go to properties uh, so first let me add some images to the solution explorer we don't have the images in the solution explorer so I have images in the my computer Go to pictures. Take. Uh, I'm going to take three pictures. I just copy it from here and add to the solution explorer. So now we have the three images. Go to image one and go to properties. Add image URL for the first one. Go to second image URL. Second one and go to third properties image url for the third one so now now you, you uh, we gave the image url to the particular image controls and for the next or previous button we are going to take two button control that is one and two so this is uh, properties one the id is button one and uh, let me give the name for this previous or better you can take this symbol and go same as in the button 2 control that is button 2 control id is button 2 and go to text here I am going to take the next button so to give the functionality for the particular buttons we just go to the we just click on the button we have the button click event so here uh, we have to write the code of c, uh, .cs c sharp code here and uh, I'm going to take one variable as a string URL and I'm storing image one dot image URL image URL uh, I'm using the swapping concept here for the slider image URL okay. so equal to image two dot image URL now image two dot image two dot image URL equal to image three dot image URL and finally image three dot three dot image URL equal to URL 
so here we write the code for the button one click event and uh, now for the next button just go and click here we have this method and here we have to write the code that is string url equal to image three dot image image three dot image url image three dot image url equal to image two dot image url now image two dot image two dot image url equal to image one dot image url and finally image one dot image url equal to url so let me debug it run ok so we have these images and for the button next button the image is coming as the next for the previous button image is coming as a previous so this is the functionality of the image slider and thanks for watching our tutorial and if you like this video just go and subscribe and you must watch our my second video and thank you so much for watching this video thank you